And here we go. This is another satellite coming through. This is the uh, XW2C satellite. Another Chinese satellite. Of course, I'm in Montreal, so it's starting to show its pass. So this one, the downlink for the beacon is... Um, so for the 2C, it's... 145790 so the beacon is there with plus or minus job doppler so that means you got to add sorry guys but I've, uh, okay here we go um 145790 plus or minus doppler and uh, the frequency range to listen to on the 2 meter band is 145795 to 815 so like i say the beacon's on 7 Nine zero, the twenty kilohertz spread to listen to is five kilohertz above, and that's twenty kilohertz up. Plus or minus Doppler, remember. So you got to go a little above and a little below, depending on what time you are and where you are in that pass. So can we hear the beacon? That's the first indication of a satellite. Here it is. I can hear it. So when you hear the beacon, you start tuning around on the upper range to see if we hear the satellites uh, with the amateur radio operators talking. This one's making a great pass that is actually show bringing me a big chunk of the United States and Canada, so it's going to be interesting. We only, only need amateur radio operators that participate. One, the signal seems to be a little weaker it could be because it's passing at a different angle so you see here it's Montreal's here so it's passing to the west of me instead of almost directly over me like the other ones before so sometimes it changes the pattern but don't give up you know even if you don't hear or you heard just a little something you're still inside the zone 
you got to continue uh, you know tuning around because that's where you're gonna get the surprise of amazing signals so don't give up as long as you're within the range of the satellite Activity, but you know a little bit of amateur radio operators and this was the XW2C and so this is pretty much concluding the pass uh, they're gonna come back you know if I look here for example if we right click and I, I, I look at the ground track there's gonna be a next pass so the other ones are gonna be a little closer there might be some activity next pass what I'm gonna do is actually look at it and if something is interesting showing up I'll post the videos for those also so that's having fun with amateur radio satellites. There's a lot of things that you can actually listen to if you just know where to listen. So hope you enjoyed this series of videos, guys.